Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living and retirement worth having. When we put these audio casts together, we're trying to teach America something. There are vixens and villains of America. Do you know that? Are you familiar with the story? That in every town and in every suburb, there's always a bastard of Satan. A bastard of Satan is usually considered a black bastard of Satan by me, but people misinterpret that and the shitbags editing my videos try and take that and make it racist. It's not. It basically means that people, even white people, even black people, even Hispanic people, even Muslim people, want to be in control and in power over someone else. It's an immoralness that is out of control. It is illness that is totally ruining us all. And if you think God in heaven hasn't brought us COVID and this pandemic or epidemic, you're totally off track with it all. Americans have lost why we became America. Americans want freedom, but they don't want to give it to others. And the truth is that freedom builds relationships, but freedom also pisses on your life. You see, freedom says that I am free, but you too are free. And freedom says I have the right to do things for me, but you also have the right to do things for you. The difference is when you cross the line to harm someone's life, face, body, whatnot, you have crossed the line of our laws. And when you cross the line of our laws, you're supposed to be liable to the law. But here's what we know. Here's what we see every day in the news. That police officers pick and choose what they're going to do to you or to me under the law. You see, they should be not aiding and abetting abuse. But many of them do the abuse to people in jail. They should be taking Muslims out of America who are here to harm us all. But they don't do that. They hire them in a jail. Now I can put together these little rhymes and I can take up all sorts of time. But what I'm saying to you is maybe nobody's listening. Maybe all this stuff that we do on YouTube and social media to try and get our jobs doesn't work at all. Maybe what we're doing is funding only a handful of companies and we're not actually bringing about employment for other people. You see, it's easy for a huge corporation or a really rich person to destroy a human life who's humble. But what's amazing in America is how many people damage their heritage. Something goes wrong in a person's life and everyone who's not been in that individual's life for years start to descend and harm them because they want more inheritance. They want more controls in their life and my attitude for that is then go find your own new husband, go find better children, but bottom line what you're creating in America are more villains and vixens across our land. You see a villain will do things wrong in the middle of the night feeling victorious that he has done this. A vixen will do things across her gossip network feeling strong that she has done this. The truth is they're both lying. Their lies says, I am in control of everybody but myself. So they put their emphasis on other people and their lives instead of focusing on the decisions they've made through their lifetime that is which has created the hell they with, are within.